know what's going on with my camera, but hey, everybody, Connie Erlin from Fort Ransom, North Dakota. Fort so Dakota. Yes. Deal with wow. The cold snaps, and then all of a sudden it's warm again. So just a little bit of my testimony before I share my husband's. Um, I was hit by a car when I was a kid. I was in a body cast with my armpits down. So weather changes like this. I have a lot of bone pain, like arthritic pain. And um, we've been on the patch for 90 days. And one thing I've noticed just as of late, because we're going through some weather changes, I haven't had zero, zero aches, none. So that's wow. a win for me. Um, also, I am in menopause stage and the night flash, hot flashes were unbelievable. My poor husband, I'm like opening the windows and it's 37 degrees out. <laughs> but, um, so that's really subsided as well. My skin, complexion, hair, um, I've lost 17 pounds. I mean, I've had, the list goes on and on for myself, but I really, really want to touch base about um, the changes in my husband. They've been miraculous. He is a type one diabetic. He has been a type one diabetic for 32, 33 years. Wow. So those that aren't familiar with type one, his pancreas doesn't work. He's insulin dependent, which means after everything he eats, he needs to have insulin to um, counteract the sugars or counteract the carbs. So another example of that is like a piece of bread is three units of insulin. So the first month he wasn't really noticing much. He was noticing that like he didn't have his aches and pains, the normal aches and pains. Um, his skin improved. His skin is marvelous. Um, his hair is getting darker. He was quite gray and it was, it's actually getting much, much darker. But on month two, he started having these random blood sugars. Like a low blood sugar is in the 50s, 40s. If it gets in the 40s, it can get really quite scary. So, I mean, it also happened with activity and whatever. I mean, if he's really busy that day doing stuff and he's just burning his calories faster and he'll have a low blood sugar. Anyways, so fast forward a couple weeks later, these randoms started progressing and they were almost every day and they have continued to be every day. So we're on 90 days, like I said, he's still experiencing anywhere from three to five low blood sugars during the day, sometimes two to three at night. So we've had to completely change what he's normally used to doing for insulin. So like I was saying, like, like a piece of bread would be three units. Now he's maybe taking one. Sometimes he eats and he doesn't take insulin at all. Wow. So, wow, this, wow. This oh, is wow. Really miraculous. And like, I know we can't say it heals, cures, whatever prevents. All I know is that our good Lord and Savior is making his pancreas work again. Oh, Amen. God. That's amazing. amazing. Yeah, I'm looking forward. We go back to his doctor in the first part of November, so I, I cannot wait to see her face and see his numbers because it's been no, nothing short of a miracle. Wow. wow. You know what? We really appreciate you coming on here and sharing that because, you know, it's not easy to share with all these people on here, but you know what? Everybody needs to be blessed. And how many, I mean, every one of us knows people that have diabetes and they need to know that this can, can help them. And again, everybody's different, but this is a huge blessing that has happened for your family, and I'm sure it's going to happen for many more. So, hey, we're so fired up to be partnered up with you two. Hey, thanks so much. I got one more thing to say real quick. I'm a dog groomer. One of my clients, I, of course, patched up, and she came back in today to order, and she said her blood sugars had dropped. They have been running high. She's a type 2 diabetic. They had been running in like the 150, 180 range even taking metformin and all of this. And I, I gave her five patches and in those five days of her being patched, it was 79. Wow. wow. Her blood sugar was 79. So people, if you are a diabetic type one, type two, any of this, I mean, please, please give this a shot because I'm telling you something will change. Something will change. 